So guys, this is a 1986 Tonka Destroyer half track. Um, from the best I could tell, they only made this in 86. Um, it's on a Chevrolet cab. It's got a Chevrolet grill on it with bow tie. It's got some rubber tracks in the back of it. And um, it's supposed to have some guns on it. The guns are missing. And as good a shape as this thing is in as possible, they were just never put on. Because the, uh, um, in the box, when these were new, the truck would sit in the box. The camera's not picking up on the light in the room, so I have a flashlight. The truck was in the box, and then cardboard, you know, was right here on either side of it. And then on the blister of the cardboard, there was, uh, there was plastic blister. It had an action figure and two machine guns. And the machine guns would go here and here, but they were not on the truck. When it was new, you had to put them on once you bought it. I don't know if you can tell, but Tonka used parts they already had for this truck um, for the most part. This is a dump truck bed. This is a dump truck cab, the Chevy cab. Um... All that they did was, instead of putting a tailgate on the dump truck, they have this piece of plastic screwed in here, a little ladder on it. It does dump. I don't think, I don't know what the purpose of it being, what of it dumping would be, other than not putting another rivet in it so it doesn't dump, but it does dump. And, um, uh... And then the the wheels, of course, are normal Tonka wheels. They probably use these these probably bulldozer tracks. But I mean, it's a pretty detailed thing. You can see the uh, leaf springs in there. It rolls really good, just like it's brand new. Um. And then this one, this one that I have here, is in pretty good shape. It's got some marks on it, but no, nothing too bad. Got a few rust spots. Um, all the plastic's good on it. Nothing's broke on it. It's got a little seat there, you know, opening. You can stick your army guys in there. As I mentioned, it's got the Chevy bow tie on the, on the front there. And, of course, a big uh, brush guard with a bunch of lights. It does have lights, headlights on it. Okay, but um, they're not as visible. On the bottom, it's got an all all metal base. Uh, you can see instead of having dual wheels like the dump trucks, the half tracks are riveted on there. Uh, and it's got a trailer hitch. Most of the dump trucks do not have a trailer hitch. Uh, it's got different tires on it than most of the. Uh, trucks did. Now the um, the tracks don't pivot at all. You know, there's no not a whole lot of suspension. However, in the front of the truck, there's quite a bit. Now this was the destroyer, and then they had some other, they had a road grader, they had a jeep. Uh, I think they had a payloader. I don't know. They had a couple different things. They were all rigged up like uh, Mad Max type of vehicles like this one here. And they actually had a comic book series of these um, that I assume they just used for promotional reasons to try to sell these. But um, I, uh, I'd i never seen one bef before and this one was in really good shape. Had nice tracks on it. Uh, it wasn't all rusty. The only thing I noticed that was up with it was the grill. Looks like it's popping out of the out of the front of the cab there. But the tab at the top smashed down in there as good as it can be. And there's nothing on the sides. So, I don't know. Maybe they just didn't fit very well. It is something a little bit different for Tonka to make something like this. And I'll be honest. 
the reason I really wanted to buy it was because I don't have very many military vehicles of this size. Uh, of course, I've got the little Tonka Jeeps. you got the old one here with the old style wheels. Then the 70s version with the uh, wider tires on it. But um, Jeeps were pretty much it. I don't have very many other old uh, you know, military vehicles this size. And I thought this uh, destroyer would be a good, uh, a good example, good, good, <clears throat> good example of one for me to buy, because it was in good shape. So, I bought this one. Uh, you can find some information about this thing online if you'd like to know more. I just googled Tonka destroyer. Uh, find images of the comic books and the other trucks that was in this series. I mean, pictures of the truck in the box. It's pretty cool. I learned a lot about it. Like, comment, subscribe for more. Have a great day, and I'll catch you in the next video.